So we're here today in Union Square somewhere. Oh, oh, you want to be able to actually hear me? Yes. yes. <laughs> that helps. All right. So we're here today in Union Square, stand with Mini Saint. Uh, what did you think of uh, today's event? Very important event. Um, I don't think a lot of people realize that problems upstate affect us here downstate. When you think about someplace as special as the Black Dirt region, um, it, it's sacred. It should be protected. And the residents of Mini Saint are on the front lines of an invasion of pollution through fracking that's coming from Pennsylvania. They're trying to compress this gas all through New York State. So we might not have wells, but we have all the infrastructure projects that bring the same pollution. So um, I think this is an extremely important event. Now, for New Yorkers that weren't here today, um, what would you like to say to them? Um, no, <laughs> it's our great sign today. It said uh, K-N-O-W, no food, no farms. And then N-O, no food, no farms. Or no farms, no food. You know, these are kinds of things that, you know, um, many people don't think about it unless they actually have a relationship with their farmers. If you shop at local farmers markets and, you know, you know your farmers, you meet your farmers, you have a great idea where your food comes from, how close it can be to you. Um, it might be different for those kinds of people. They might have an understanding about how significant it is to protect farms. But, uh, you know, if you have such a distance from the land, understanding our significance um, in relationship to the land, um, I, I think that it, it, that's something that people need to kind of um, have an epiphany about. Because as, as much as we like to think that we're separate from these things, okay. we're, we're not at all. And um, there were a lot of good points made today about uh, the dairy industry that gets into the cows, that gets into the milk, that gets into the children. And these are things that I, I think are completely unacceptable. As a, as a mother, as a consumer, as a citizen of New York, um, I, I just think it's unacceptable. Just like Craig Stevenson's, we're all connected. Absolutely, everything is connected. You know, you think about it, it's like big industries of any kind that are able to roll over the little people, or think they're able to roll over the little people. Um, you know, there's a, there's a corruption that comes along with that. And so the antidote to that is, you know, to bring things back into local communities where you have to actually face and interact with the people that you're serving as, uh, as a customer, uh, as a consumer, and as a business owner. Uh, there's no way that you can have the same sort of relationship and understand how your, your actions as a business affect your community if you never set foot in it. So um, I think that what I hope for is that there's a revolution of smaller things coming more into the front lines and, and businesses can go back to serving the communities where they live and business owners are connected to the communities where they live. And, and, and when that, when that is reality, things like this will never be allowed to happen. Stand with mini sink, uh, ban fracking, kick out all fossil fuels. Do this. I know I, I got to speak at um, the EPA, they had a listening session last week, and I said, You know, I believe in this country, I believe in this land, and I believe in the people here. And I know that um, we don't need this gas, we don't need this pollution, and if we demand enough and we're loud enough, we'll get what we want. Great. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>